Hey YouTubers, it's Mark from uh, Truth Seeker, and I'm in Soul 647. Uh, the quality of this picture is so bad. Uh, I'm just gonna be able to point out a couple of anomalies, and you know, like usual, you gotta download it. You definitely gotta take a look at this. All right, uh, let's let's see what we can get out of this. Because I, I find it to be very interesting. There's a circular object here, okay? There's a weird object back here. But it's hard to tell. I mean, it looks like, it almost looks like a building in this area right here. In this front area. Then back here you can see there's a pipe. That comes up into some type of ball. rocks just don't look like that. Then back here, what they want us to believe is mountains. There's there's structure in this. I don't believe it's mountains. I believe they're covering up something. Here looks like some type of uh, base that's holding something up. But they moved some of the pixels around and you could see where they just removed pixels and removed parts here looks to be a carving but there's another structure uh, there's a lot going on back here and I don't believe it's mountains but uh, I'm just not uh, I don't have the uh, really the skill set to start messing with that because if I do I know that I know what I can do and I can't do the first thing people are going to say to me is, oh, you're adding all types of stuff to it, so I'm going to stay away from that. But you want to take a look at it, download it, play with it, you know, play with all the color settings and stuff and some of the tools and see what you can get out of it. I I'm sure I can guarantee it's going to be interesting what you're going to find in this mountain range. Now here it looks to be some type of open dome. See how it's, you know, like those salt sheds, that they have those big salt sheds that they build. This is something that I would take to be close to that. I mean, look at it. It's like a big dome, and then half of it's opened. All right, let me take you to over here. Now, look at this item. You could see the structure in it. It's got a huge shadow. So whatever it is, it's raised on some type of pedestal or base. Because of the shadow. Can you see this thing? What the hell are we looking at? come over to this area. Look at this building. This is some type of structure. It's got a perfectly square window. Okay. Bring you in. And in front of it looks to be some type of statue or something carved, but like I said, the quality is so bad. It's amazing that I can even show you this. Now, if anybody out there that does these videos, if you want to redo this with, you know, the skill set that you have and what you have available to you, go right ahead and do it. You don't even have to give me credit for it. <laughs> I just, I would love to see it done because uh, it's just an amazing, amazing picture. But we're only allowed to see you know, a certain part of it. I mean, there's big chunks of the spectrum that are taken out of the picture. Now look at this piece. This comes up in the air, and it bends and comes down. It's like a piece coming up, 
and then it's got like another piece see how that just hangs in the air like you would sit under that like it would be a sunshade or something that's not what it is but that's I mean, what the hell can I equate it to you know look what's on the side of it there's some type of there's this machinery you can see there's like a big rivet and you got this circular item here I mean, how do you even describe this stuff? See the perfect circular hole? Looks to be like a pyramid back here. This, one, this almost looks like a carving that they blurred the bottom part of it. There would be one eye, another eye. This, this area right back here I found to be very interesting. See how this has got like a pipe or something sticking out too? It's the perfect square hole. I mean, that's some type of structure, something. Just, that's the best that I can get it for you. And I come over to this weird thing. Now that could just be a rock, but it's got some very strange symmetry to it, and then it's got these weird carvings. So, I don't know. come over to this area. See how this looks like piping? And it looks like there's something coming out of the ground. See how the ground looks to be opened? And there's all types of masking. I mean, this picture is just mutilated. I mean, basically, back here, we're just, we're getting glimpses, like, between pixels. Here's another piece that looks to be suspended somehow, raised. And you can see the shadow. But the angle that we're seeing these shadows just does not seem right. You know, if we're looking dead on, you know, straight ahead from the ground. It just doesn't look right. It looks like we're up in the air looking down on this stuff. It's just very confusing, you know. When you start trying to analyze shadows and directions and... But that's what NASA wants to do. They want to confuse you. And then I found this little area pretty interesting. Now, it doesn't show up great on video, but there's a metallic object sitting right here. Half of it's blurred. You can see where it's cut right off. It's got a silver layer that comes down. Then there's a black layer with one hole, another hole, a silver layer with a ball on top. Then there's this weird hole or carving in here. There's this what looks to be a hut with an opening. And then there's one stone, two, three, four, five, six stones. But look at how they're placed. And a perfect arc. Then when you come back here, 
50-50 shot. It looks like a person working back here sitting down. Looks like he's sitting down on something here with this in front of him. That's his head, his hair, his shirt, his pants, and he's sitting down on something. That's what it looks like on my screen. That's why I tell everybody, download it and, you know, see what you think. But it's a very strange area because everything looks staged in that area. You know, you got a little hut. It just doesn't make sense. I don't know. You know, is this an oven that they use? You have fire in it. You know, you cook on the top of it. I, you know, who knows? Who only knows? Anything is possible. In one of my videos, I have a little oven. I, I think it's either a little hut or oven. And uh, it looked like it had smoke coming out of it in one of my videos. Same exact design and everything. So who knows what's going on there. We'll never know. Because NASA is never going to tell us the truth. Look at this item. It looks like another one of those little huts. Look what's coming out of it. Like, what is even, you know, what is this stuff even? It's got like a little pole or a hook or something coming out of it. I mean, you could see it, it's there. And you got this weird item next to it. Then you come over to this strange piece. A little hole there. Comes down, comes across. See how they blacken this part out? There's another little piece that comes out. And then you come over to this area towards the back and look at this piece. It looks like there was some type of statue in here that they uh, used the eraser on. This piece. This looks to be like a piece of pottery just sitting there. Back here, you have what looks to be like some type of structure, either monument or it's got a little doorway, and there's something carved out on the side of it. Almost looks to be metallic. And then they they use the black tool here. Here they put black blocking. Here, here. There's a bunch of little spots here where they put some of this black blocking. And it's interesting where they choose to put it. Because it really changes the way you look at the picture. And finally, you got this area here. Look at this huge monolith that's sticking up. Look at this shadow it's leaving. It almost looks like there's stuff carved here. I mean, you see how we're looking at the shadows? It's like you're looking from above. At a little bit of an angle, you know? And here's something else that they, they used, uh, the black blocking. See, here's another another piece that's sticking up out of the ground. Another little structure. Hey, you see this? What I'm talking about? 
Now this thing comes straight up. And it looks to be like some type of carving here. Here's another item that's coming straight up. It's leaving a heavy shadow. I mean, look at look at these things. The bends, the circular openings. It's just wild. Absolutely wild. Every time I open one of these pictures, I never know what to expect. You know, some people say, oh yeah, well, you know, it's only carving statues and machinery. And yeah, but you know what? You never know what to expect. It's absolutely amazing. You have the passion and love like a bunch of us do that do this. You know, every time you open a picture, it's like Christmas morning to us. If it's not, then you shouldn't be doing these videos and stuff, but I can never get bored of this stuff. Part of me almost hopes that there's never there never is disclosure. It's weird in a way, but you know, I'm torn. I want it. And then if there was, then there would be no need for me, you know, everything would be out there. So it's weird, you know. I'm sure a lot of people that do this would feel the same way. You know, we want the truth out there, but imagine if tomorrow was, you know, oh yeah, NASA puts all the original pictures out. You know, it would almost be a little bit of a letdown to some of us in a weird way. Strange way, but, you know, we, the people that do this really love doing it. You could tell. I mean, there's people out there that put out these stupid videos you know, with am animations in it, and, you know, uh, aliens walking around, giving you the finger, and, you know, uh, pictures with no links to n nothing, you know. And what's sad is some of them get, you know, a couple hundred thousand hits. And then I see somebody out there that's working their butt off, you know, with 400 hits on a video. You know, where's the justice in that, you know what I mean? It's, uh, because there's a lot of people out there that are putting these videos out that are just making a joke. But, uh, you know, to the people out there that take this seriously, I got all the respect in the world for you. Highly intelligent people with open minds. You know. But, uh, that's strange. I'll see you on the next one, guys. True Seekers out.